So now it's up to the freshman Finley who has driven in the lone Michigan run tonight. Hard hit the foul. Now right here, I, I would think that Angelica Selden is gonna pitch very carefully to Finley, knowing that she's got Motika on deck, so, someone that has not been as successful as Finley has. You do not want to give it to Finley because Finley is aggressive. She could potentially swing herself out of this at bat. Finley leads the World Series and hits an RBIs. Two on board for Michigan with two outs. The Wolverines have never been here before, looking for their first ever softball national championship. Never as a team from the Eastern time zone. Won the title and taken it back across the Mississippi River. And Finley launches that one deep. And gone. And the freshman delivers the three-run home run for Michigan. She waits for that miss. And that rise ball does not get in, does not get up, and she is all over that. Unbelievable three-run bomb for Samantha Finley. Michigan preparing for this national championship all season. They knew they were loaded coming back this year. After a disappointing end in the World Series last season. And this will do it. Merchant at short records the final out. And for the first time in school history, the Michigan Wolverines are the national champions. seven previous trips of coming up short. A gutsy pitching performance from Jenny Ritter throughout and freshman Samantha Finley driving in all four runs tonight, including the game winners on a three run blast in the top of the 10th inning. And the Bruins come up short in their bid for the three-peat. Well, as you mentioned, a gutsy performance by Janie Ritter. And as she watches intently that final out, the sense of relief knowing that all that work and all those innings result in a national championship. And you just got to tip your hat off to these Michigan players. Finley, the freshman being able to come through. Ritter, the junior. That's what it takes if you're going to be able to get it done is coming through when it matters most. And this Michigan team had the fight. Let's take a look at the Pontiac game-changing performance in the top of the 10th inning. A tie score with two on, Samantha Finley. UCLA elected to pitch to her, and she sends it out. That gave the Wolverines the 4-1 lead, and that's the way it ended. Let's check in now with Holly Rowe down on the field. Coach Hutchins, your team set the goal from the first day of fall practice to win the national championship. What's it like to see these ladies do it? I am so proud of my group and for every kid who's ever wore the maize and blue. This is for all of them. They're all here with us. They're all watching now. This is for all of them. My kids just were outstanding all year and they never gave up. They were gutsy. Jenny Ritter was gutsy. They were awesome. We're awesome. Samantha Finley, you're just a freshman. You, you drove in all four runs tonight. How did you have the composure at the plate? Um, you know what? It wasn't me, it was my whole team. And you know what? 
I don't think we would have made it here without the whole team with Ritter pitching and the defense. I mean, the offense comes around, but it was the defense and it was the team and it was the coaches. It was all of us together. Jenny Ritter, you were just terrific in this circle. How did you get the composure? Bases loaded, the bottom of the ninth, but you kept fighting. How was that able to happen? Well, I just gave it all I got. My team said, leave it all out on the field. My coach said, have the guts out there, and my defense was behind me to back me up. Well, the first national championship ever for the Michigan Wolverines. And, Coach, what does it feel like to finally get that first one? It's just, I don't know if you can ever describe it, but to be honest, whether we got this or not, my kids have just been the most invested team. They have played for Michigan. They've won for Michigan. They believed in Michigan. It's really all about that. They made it come through, but it's, it's about that. It's not about the championship, but I'll tell you what, it feels good. <laughs> well, the first ever championship for the East. Way to represent the East Coast, ladies. Thank you. Jenny Ritter. Jenny Thanks Ritter. a lot, Holly. And the championship trophy will find a home in Ann Arbor. A tough way to go out for UCLA, but everybody will be back next year for the Bruins. Michigan will lose just Motika and Merchant. And what a moment for Michigan, the first ever national championship for the Wolverines. Four to two, the final here at the Women's College World Series. A reminder coming up next, it's Sports Center and the Michigan Wolverines 4 1 over UCLA to win the national championship. And it will head back to Ann Arbor. This has been a presentation of ESPN, the worldwide leader in sports. For Stacey Newman, Lisa Fernandez, and Holly Rowe, I'm Beth Mowens. Good night from Oklahoma City. Ritter celebrating the final out after the Finley three-run home run to win it in the 10th.